Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and new uh, fantasy cards just came out. And I actually came out about an hour ago, uh, but we are going to hop in. I'm going to show you guys the the guys. Sorry, I haven't done this for a couple weeks. I haven't shown you the uh, the new fantasy cards when they came out, but we're going to do it this week. So first, we've got Wallace Gilberry. I forget what position he plays. Hold on, let me look. He is a left end. Okay, I knew he played for the Bengals. I just Forgot if he was a left or a right end. Uh, let's see, are there any other left ends that? No. There's Wallace Gilberry. He's uh, 2,000 coins, and he's uh, I'm actually gonna buy him. 2,000 coins, 84 overall. Uh, there are his stats if you want to see him real quick. Uh, I just bought him because I can always uh, I can always use him. I guess he's not the greatest. I'm not like gonna start him over uh, Muhammad Wilkerson, but. He's not terrible. Uh, so next we've got Pierre Thomas. Halfback Saints. 85, I believe. I believe he's an 85 overall. Uh, yes, he is. He is 3,000 coins. And there are his stats. Um, nothing impressive enough to make me buy him, seeing how I have too many running backs, really, if you think about it. Uh, but... Uh, it's an it's he's a good card. Um, if you're a uh, if you're a Saints fan, just like Pierre Thomas, definitely definitely go with him. He's not like a terrible card. I just have no use for him. Uh, but if I see any of these guys cheap enough, I will buy him because um, I do actually need some stuff. T. Y. Hilton here, short pass. Actually, I need short pass wide receivers, kind of, kind of. But I don't really want T. Y. Hilton. Uh, he's got 95 speed though, like a monster. Um, Whole lot cheap. That's a 95 speed. So he is 8,000, and that Demarius Thomas is like 80,000. And they have the same. The only reason I bought the Demarius is for the speed. But Demarius is taller, and I don't really need the speed if I think about it, because I got Deshaun and Tavon Austin. Uh, so that's not really a big deal for me. Um, next, we have Tremaine Brock, who is a cornerback for the 49ers. Back. 49ers. There he is, Tremaine Brock. 16,000. He is zone defense, 94 speed, nice, 91 man, 88 press, pretty beast. Um, I definitely take him, but doesn't really fit my chemistry. I know a bunch of people have been talking about how chemistry doesn't matter. I don't know, it just gives me an element of a challenge to the game to try to, you know, work with the chemistry and whatnot, and I believe it still does do stuff. Uh, but here is the Daryl Washington, 89, pass rush, 25K. Um, pretty good stats, 93 pursuit, 91 tackle, 87 speed. A uh, whole lot better upgrade for me at middle linebacker, but I can't use him uh, because he's not man, man D. Well, I can't even think. Uh, but here's the final... Uh, actually, this isn't the final. There's still the stars of the week. But uh, we got Kerry Williams, Eagles player. He is 6,000. Uh, plus he can run stuff. Um, for 6,000, I can let his price drop more. It's just the day one release. I can wait. Uh, but I will buy him because he's an Eagles, obviously. Um, so now we're going to move on to the stars of the week. I'm not sure if uh, this first one is a star of the week. Uh, but we will see. Uh, it's Julius Thomas, if you haven't noticed yet. Um, no, he's not. He's 40k, 90 overall, speed run. Mmm, those stats are... Those stats, McGundy? Let's see here. No, those stats are pretty good for a tight end. Um, yeah, they just look weird. They just look off. Like, I don't know, I feel like tight ends... I don't know, it's pretty good stats. I feel like, I don't know. I don't know, I feel like the tight end stats should be better than that, but I guess I'm wrong. Um, so next we've got Olshan Jeffrey, who I actually want, but I'm not going to pay some ridiculous price for him because he's star of the week, so it's probably going to be expensive. Uh, 70k, he's not a star of the week. Somebody told me it was a star of the week. 10 receptions, 218 yards, and a touchdown. Monster. He broke the Bears record, I think. Uh, he's just got some all-around good stats. Ground and pound's not my chem, so, uh, but I think I have the offensive one, uh, the coach that boosts chemistry, so I can kind of stray away on offense. Uh, next we've got P. Sizzle, uh, who I actually really want to get, but he's going to be so expensive, it's not even going to be worth it. Uh, 
let's see here, Ravens, 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 there we go. Suggs, 175,000, 93 overall, he does get the boost command defense, and I think I also have his elite version, so we can compare. Yep, there are the Suggs, speed went up 5, agility went up 8, awareness went up 2, tackle went up 6, block shin went up 9, Strength, same, play rec went up 8, and pursuit went up 2. Uh, so definitely a major improvement. Uh, I get him, but I don't really want to spend the coins. And then the last one is Romo, which I think you got to do the collection to get him. But I'm not 100% sure, so I'm not sure. I think he's a 95. Anyway. 95. Okay, load. Yeah, you're going to have to do the collection to get him. Uh, probably fantasy collectibles again. Uh, there's the collection. Let's go into the collections. Stephon Gilmore. There he is. There's Tony. Uh, he's just the same as every other week. Uh, just get the five collectibles, collect them, and you get the Tony Romo. Uh, kind of wish I would have done the Dominican Sue. Kind of, not really. Uh, kind of disappointed I did the Rodgers, kind of, kind of. Um, he's still a boss, Rodgers is still a boss, but I don't really need him. I wish I could kind of sell him, but that's not going to happen. Uh, I think this is telling me I bought, yeah, I bought Wallace Gilberry. Uh, but if anybody wants to offer on my uh, LaShawn McCoy, I do have him up. I am selling him. Uh, he is number six out of 100. I'll remove him, and I'll put him on the trade block. Um, just to see if anybody wants to offer. I did sell that Chris Johnson and Demarius Thomas. I was like, I don't really need these guys. Um, and now I'm considering selling the LaShawn McCoy. So I'm going to send him to the trade block. If anybody has some good offers for me, hit me up. Um, I'm willing to sell him. I uh, don't want to lose anything on him because he is numbered and he is an Eagles player and he's low numbered. Uh, so I'm not going to sell him for anything less than really what he's worth. But if you have any offers like cards or coins... Um, yeah, just let me know. Also, they came out with the Warren Sap, which I really want. Uh, but I really think I need to save my coins until the VIT comes out. Whether it comes out on this gen or next, uh, doesn't really matter. I know he's going to come out because they're coming out with all of them. Um, but there's the Sap. He's 232,000. Doesn't fit my chem, but <coughs> uh, Warren Sap is just a monster. So I'd love to get him, but. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking I need to save and uh, be smart about this so I can get the player I want and I can afford him and I can get it done and, you know, have enough. If I have to pay like 700000 for a Vic, you know I will, uh, but I gotta start saving. Only got 100 but I could always sell that McCoy. I can probably get 200 easy for him, uh, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna explore out the options with him, see if anybody wants to buy him for anything, trade me. I don't know. The only thing... Um, is you have to go first. That's like the only rules that I have. Um, and so yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and make sure you go check out my NBA uh, 2K14 My Team videos if you like NBA or if you just like my content, which I hope the majority of you do. Uh, go check those out. i be posting lots of booster openings and um, maybe full gameplays here and there because that's that, I think I've come to that conclusion that I'm just going to do full gameplays just simply because everybody cuts their gameplays down. Uh, there might be people out there that like to, like me, I like to listen to long uh, videos. Um, that's, just, that's just my opinion. Uh, but maybe there's some of you that like that, and so I can bring that to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.